What up, Slacker? Slacker out here. Welcome back to Vampire. Let's get now. I gotta beat my sister. She is a turning into a real bitch. So uh, she's been difficult. So let's see if I can do it. Okay. Now I know. Hold on. I I I've tried so much. I need to hide out. Hide out. Hide out. Where is this merchant? Merchant may change their wares differently depending on their what I need to get to a hideout is what I'm trying to say because I need to upgrade I have 3000 XP and I, I I've tried like for like two and a half hours to try to beat her and I can't so I need to upgrade bad how do we get out of here? Which which is the exit? I'm assuming this way, and I'm going the wrong way. Oh, are you serious? Oh my god, I didn't know there was a fucking vampire in here. Can I use that bed to upgrade? Fuck, it looks like no. Where the hell am I? What? Okay. That's awesome. I don't know this was here. Okay. <clears throat> well, at least I can upgrade. <sighs> Just do it. Um. Blood capacity. Let's do that. Um, oh, shit. Okay, I can't do that. Body condition, physical prowess. Let's upgrade that, I guess. Increased damage inflicted. Yeah, let's do this, definitely. Okay. Let's increase my health. Cart, bridge bag, and grease a number of bullets. Oh, okay. Um. Ooh, yes. Yes. Okay. 
What about this? Nope. Okay. What's this? All right, let's let's upgrade this for now. Okay. Hopefully, this will give me the edge I need to finally get out, or to finally beat her. I guess. Ooh, definitely light regeneration serum, light stamina serum. No. Any these? This? And I don't have enough. Okay. Rusty box of pills, whatever. Okay. I'm guessing I still can't upgrade my sword. Increase damage dealt by 10%. Whatever. Ah. <sighs> No. Can I upgrade this? Ooh, yes I can. Fuck yeah. Okay. Alright, fine. Let's do this. Let's go back. Alright. Let's beat this bitch. Let's stop Mary. Beat the shit out of her. I've been doing this for over an hour. Oh my god. Let's do this. Oof. Whoa. Yes. Come on. Kiss me again, sweet. Okay. Bitch! Stop! Stop hitting me! Come 
to me, Johnny. Run, run. Oh, fuck. Fuck me, dude. Come on. How? I was far away. Oh my God. I could have beaten her that time too. All right, I'm going to beat you. I'm upgraded. I'm going to beat your ass. I'm going to beat it. Okay. Bitch. Stop. Stop hitting me. I hate you. I hate you. Eat you. Come on. Come on! That should have hit. Oh my god. Rest in peace, monster. You've spared the precious nurse brain. Come on. Oh my god. Bulimic motherfucker, stop throwing up. You killed me, brother. Shut up. Okay, middle. Stay in the middle. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Far away that time, bitch. Alright, oh shit, 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 oh shit. No, stop being tired, stop being tired. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck. Run, run. No, I don't want to. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. I hate you so bad.
Run. Oh, I thought she was gonna do that exploding shit. No. No. Fuck. No, no. Come on, just keep dodging, just keep dodging. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, come on. No, yes. Ooh, one more fucking hit. Yes, yes, bitch. Fuck you. Oh, hour and ten minutes. Fuck. Brother, it's time to bring this conversation to an end forever. You know, I will not play this game. No, I don't want to kill you. You're my sister. Like a rabid dog. Or think you're performing an autopsy. Don't be ridiculous. I'll kill them all. The kind Dr. Swansea. The sweet little lass with hair of red. I am the harbinger bringing your punishment. Mary. Don't you see? This is not me. Flesh that never ages. All nightmare. No dream. Bring it to a close. Let me sleep. Ah. <sighs> No, they're gonna make me decide, aren't they? They didn't let me. Oh. A cure, Mary. Oh, sh. Then, at last, I can forgive you. Oh. Fuck. Wait, is this me? This is me. I can't turn though, I'm just pressing forward. Where am I going? Okay. Oh, I still gotta press forward, okay. Damn. Feel sad for him, just nothing but fucking pain. A few nights later, huh? Transmitted through the blood via violent biting, turning survivors into frenzied immortals. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am a vampire, born anew into an age of death and pestilence. While plotting factions close in around me, I am sworn to find the source of this epidemic. I am convinced greater perils are still to come. I know uh. the answers I seek are hiding in our blood. Uh-huh. Damn. Chapter 4, Rising Fever. Uh, Dr... Okay, I'm gonna try to read the book. Dr... <laughs> Dr. Reed, uh, I hope this letter will quickly find you, for I need to speak to you as soon as possible. The situation is evolving very quickly in the West End, and I'm convinced, uh, I'm convinced we are all now in great danger. The guard of Prywin has launched a great hunt in London, and for a few nights they have been acti actively searching and killing any Ekon they can locate. So that's the type of vampire I am. I am. 
or he is, he's an Ekon. They will lo locate Lord, any Ekon they can locate, Lord Redgrave, chairman of the Ascalon Club, recently contacted me, he wishes to meet you immediately. Damn, okay, please come to the mansion any night that suits you, we must discuss all of this. With this letter, you will find an official pass that will allow you to go through any barricade or quarantine checkpoint throughout the city. Your friend, Lady Ashbury. Okay. Damn. Situation serious. Ooh, I got some... The flower's dying. It needs water. Well, can I give it fucking water? Where's the water? Where's the water? Where's the water? Where's the water? All right, I'm gonna upgrade. Okay, blood capacity needs to go up. Yeah, that needs to go up. Let's see, my greatest, um, my bite and my claws, I feel are really handy. Um. Let me see what this does again. Range, high range. Some abilities are also are so powerful that even vampires fear them. Abyss is one of them. The vampire concentrates summoning the shadows in their purest, darkest form. These shadows capture the vampire's prey and toys with it like a cat with a mouse. After a brief moment, the shadows strike the impaling the impaling their prey. Because of dark nature, the type of ability used too often, even a powerful vampire is vulnerable. Blood by the tendrils of darkness. Hmm. I don't know about that then. Um. Let's see. No, I can't do that. Let's upgrade this one. Oh, wait. I already did. Hmm. Oh, I never... Okay, okay, okay. That's right. I... S um... What about one of these? Right? You perf you perform a supernatural move your target and cause damage upon landing. Okay. Let's do it. What's the net? Okay. Alright, I'll read those when I'm done. F for now. Let's see. How about any physical prowess? No, I need a thousand. Any... I need a thousand. Big thirst, I need six hundred. Just barely not enough. Alright, I'll... There we go, that's enough. Go to La Lady Ashbury's mansion. Alright. And that's that way. Do it, let's do it, let's do it. Don't want to run into them. What? This dude again. Oh, okay. You're my maker, and you're doing shit in my heads. Who are you? 
Damn, those horns, though. I swear, every time I see them, it looks creepy. The Vanished Queen has awoken? I am... I'm, I'm not, not your, your champion. champion. But yeah. Of course you are, son. As surely as you are the blood of my blood. I had to kill Mary. I have known your pain, child. Do not succumb to... Silence! I dismiss you now. The land calls for a champion. All and everyone needs you. Hmm. Silence. I'm tired of all these puppet shows. Damn. Okay then. Fucking a. All right, let's. Uh, no, nope, no, thank you. I'm gonna go this way. I want to go. Yeah, I want to go this way. I said. Bitch, who are you? Um, how can I go through? I'll show the war. Whatever this poor woman did. Nobody deserves this kind of punishment. Okay. This way? Is that it? No more? Okay. Come on. Fuck. Nope. Come on. Come on. Come on, bitch. Bitch? I was trying to fucking save you. Give me your blood, motherfucker! I was trying to help you! You're a fellow vampire and you're being attacked, motherfucker! I hate you, ass. What you got? What you got? This way? Nope, I don't think this way. Ooh, shiny over there. Alright. Let's go this way. So this is, this is where she lives. Oh shit. Fuck yeah! Look at that shit! Look at this house! That's a fucking mansion! That's a... Big house! I want that house! Give me this house! Can I live with you, lady? Lady? Lady, I wanna live with you! Shit, your shit is fancy! I want it! Hi! What's up, baby girl? How are you? Let me in! As good as one can be, considering the circumstances. Yes. Death and affliction seem prevailing themes of late. Please, come in. We have much to discuss. Mm-hmm. I hope I haven't disturbed you. 
Not at all. Actually, I was counting on you visiting me tonight. How strange, this painting. Beautiful, melancholic, yet with a haunting dignity. Indeed. A long time ago, a friend asked me to paint this for him. But I kept it in the end. I did not know you were a painter, my lady. There are many things you do not know about me, young Ekon. Oh shit, sorry, fucking A. Stop calling me that. Call me Jonathan. Um, where's my mouse? Oh, okay. Call me Jonathan. Please call me Jonathan. Please excuse my behavior, Jonathan. I tend to tease my friends when uneasy. What is bothering you, my lady? Your letter was quite alarming. We will talk about this in a few minutes. For now, I would like you to tell me about yourself. How have you been since we last met, my friend? Oh, shit. I had to kill my sister. My maker must be powerful. Uh, yeah. My sister, Mary. My, my sister. She was made a vampire in the same way I was. She was the one killing all those people everywhere I went. Vengeance is a powerful force for those betrayed. Made vampire through careless error. Victims by surprise. Mm-hmm. I didn't I want that. I did not intend that. If only I had known then how vampires are created. That is the scientist hmm. speaking. In truth, most of us do not know how it really works. Personally, I make sure my prey will not return to haunt me. What do you mean? I am merciless, Jonathan. I only feed on the dying. And I make sure they are dead before leaving their remains. Hmm. Uh, good to know. In the end, she implored me to put an end to her misery. But still, I felt I had taken her life twice. I am so sorry for my accidental cruelty. Had I known your dear Mary was still alive, I would never have sent you to pray for her soul in that church. There is no need to apologize, my lady. Your words have been most helpful in these difficult times. Thank you, my yeah. friend. If For sure. only we could have guided your poor sister through her terrible They speak so moment. elegantly. I wish we still spoke that way. So I'm I'm sorry. Thank you so much in this time of need and delicateness and all of that. So fancy. Uh my I my maker. The conclusion that my maker, whoever he might be, must be a powerful vampire. Certainly extremely old. How have you reached this conclusion? Hmm. I felt his power. This power, radiating like an aura every time he appeared. Most ancestral vampires of England were killed by the guard of Prewen half a century ago. I wonder who your maker could be. You have no idea who he could be? Some of the ancient ones fled England. Some may still be in hiding. All I know hmm. is you, my friend, are a pawn in some secret and obscure game of chess. Hmm. Is the only immortal I've seen appear in an ethereal form. His voice, his words seemed ancient. It was disturbing. I am afraid you are right. The simple fact that your blood made Mary such a strong Ekon proves that you must be of ancient lineage. Hmm. I think I should ask the questions, Your Ladyship. After all, it was you who invited me to settle this most urgent of matters. Fair enough. True that. True that. The situation is critical. We do not have the luxury for etiquette. Please do not misunderstand me. I would be delighted to discuss mundane matters and idle trivialities. If we survive the dark nights to come, we shall have all the time in the world to speak, you and I. For now, please follow me, Jonathan. For sure, let's do it, girl. Who, 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 who,
advantages of living forever is having the time to be selective with one's furnishings. Hmm. I took the liberty of having tea served. You can still drink tea. Can't keep it down, but I do so enjoy the aroma. Let us toast to make believe. And of course, to your health, Jonathan. And to yours, my lady. Mm-hmm. So let's sniff clinky and sniff the tea. Mmm, that shit smell good. Pretty. So, my lady, why truly did you invite me here? I've been asked to deliver an official invitation to meet the Ascalon Club. Mmm. Who are they? Really? They are the embodiment of vampire law in Britain. Some say they influence the destiny of the Empire. Some believe they merely protect it. Mm. Okay. Um. Will they fight Prewin? I doubt it. Fergal was Lord Redgrave's executioner forever and a day. By defeating that beast, you deprived them of a powerful weapon. Hmm. How many are there? Only a small number of powerful and deceitful immortals. Hmm. All of them entangled in a sticky web of shadow cabinets, influencing trade. Okie dokie. Um. Why use you? Because they know we are close. The Ascalon Club has many spies. Their main occupation is gathering information and then deciding how to use it. Hmm. Did they threaten you? Not at all. Their message surprised me at first. But it is only logical, considering the critical situation in London. Hmm. Why not ask your help? Why not ask for your help? Since you are obviously a powerful and influential immortal yourself. You have to understand that I am invisible to the eyes of Ascalon, for I am a woman. That oh, it's all men? Well, as long as they leave me alone. That's... They're sexist vampire motherfuckers, I swear. Dumb. Should, Should I trust, I trust them? them? Of course not. Hell not. Do yeah. not misunderstand me. They can be very useful. But I believe their long-term goals differ from yours. Hmm. Why meet them? Why meet them then? Because nothing truly important can be achieved in this city without their consent. They could be powerful allies in this current situation. Hmm. Should I lie to them? We all lie, Jonathan. It falls to you to choose your behavior. The most important rule is to show them due respect. Okay, show them respect and you'll get far. I got I heard the message. I got you loud and clear. Have they always they been have there? Done nothing but impede my investigation since I became known to them. Why would they want to see me now? I guess they now see you as Ascalon material. They must have oh. found out what happened to your sister. Proof of the potent blood flowing through your veins. I'm not sure I can accept their invitation. I have seen their handiwork. How Fergal the Beast imposed the club's law. You have no choice, Jonathan. Even I would not openly defy Lord Redgrave, the chairman of the Ascalon Club. Hmm. Who is Lord Redgrave? What can you tell me about Lord Redgrave? Who is he? Lord Redgrave is the founder and chairman of the Ascalon Club. Most mortals know him as the Earl of Bristol. He is rich and extremely influential. Mm hmm. Have you met him? Have you met him? Only on rare occasions, for he never goes outside the club. And women are not awarded membership, even immortals. That's dumb. How old is he? Is he? How long has he been a vampire? Lord Redgrave claims to be the progeny of William Marshall, the most valiant knight who ever lived. If that is true, he could be very old. Mm -hmm. I don't know who William Marshall is. How probable is, How is his reach? His reach? The Ascalon Club may be the most influential secret society in England. 
Not all its members are immortals, but they are all very powerful. Mm-hmm. They are not all immortals. How is that? The club is mainly comprised of political figures who seek the safety and expansion of the Empire. The most loyal are awarded immortality. Oh, so that's how they keep them, keep them in their reigns, I guess. Any familiar or famous names? As the richest, most relentless British tycoon, Aloysius Dawson is considered ideal Ascalon material and has been watched for years. Okay. If you are convinced I must meet him, I will heed your advice. Thank you, Jonathan. I understand your reluctance to brush shoulders with London's vampire elite. But we have no choice. Is the situation okay. that critical? Yes. The guard of Prewen has called for a second great hunt of our kind. And they will stop at nothing to eliminate us. Okay. Oh my god, just get to the damn meeting already. Prewen and Ascalon will fight. What is there? Will uh. the guard of Prewen and the Ascalon Club fight each other? I doubt it. If Prewen really launched a great hunt, I think most of the Ekons I know would flee the country to escape the bloodbath. Mm -hmm. I think I saw them kill an Ekon on the way to your house. Mm. They seem to have a list with names. To launch another great hunt, they must have collected intelligence on vampire identities and whereabouts. They are a resourceful lot. All right. Should we fight back? I will not be hunted down like an animal again. I admire your courage, Jonathan. But the best way to fight them is to put an end to the epidemic. This is the only way to clear the air. All right. What is a great hunt? The first great hunt was launched about 75 years ago. In just a few nights, the guard of Prewen located and destroyed most of the old British vampires. Okay. Why start a second one? Prewen has always seen us immortals as a threat to mankind. My guess is they suspect one or more of us is the cause of the epidemic. How did you survive the first hunt? I fled, Jonathan. Like most vampires who survived that slaughter. And I secretly came back when I was sure they had lost my trail. Ooh. Sneaky, sneaky girl. You should flee then. Leave London, the country even. I have seen the guard in action. They are merciless. Your concern warms my heart, Jonathan. But fear not. If the situation gets too dangerous, I shall retreat to my secret Scottish manor. I could hide you in my luggage. If you wish. <laughs> Thank you for the offer. I shall keep it in mind, but I have much to do here. There is a question I must ask you. Could Lord Redgrave be my maker? I doubt it. If Lord Redgrave had made mm. you his progeny, he would not have seemed so surprised when you demonstrated the strength of your lineage. Mm, okay. What is the plan? The plan is we both try to save this city you and i go to ascalon accept their proposition and use their influence to promote your agenda how can i save london I save london the epidemic is the priority you must find its origin and put an end to it this is the best way to solve the crisis okay what will you do i still have contacts and old friends in this town I shall make some inquiries and attempt to learn more of the situation. We need clarity. Got you. I got you. I hear you. Will I ever discover the identity of my maker? Maybe not, Jonathan. We know for sure mm. you were made by a powerful vampire. But most of those fled England long ago. Was it you? I keep... Uh... You have no idea at all? You seem to know so many things about the secrets of the vampire underworld. Even if I had my suspicions, 
I would not dare give you a name so soon. All I can say is this. I will make inquiries and keep you informed. All right, it wasn't you for sure, it wasn't you. Forgive my bluntness, but I have to ask. Was it you? Did you make me? Oh, Jonathan. I know you shall always have a gnawing doubt about who made you an immortal. But I swear, I had nothing to do with it. Okie dokie, bitch. One day soon, I will have to find the answer to this mystery. And I shall help you in your research, I promise. For now, you must go uh -huh. to the Ascalon Club and Ascalon. play their game. Will I see you again at the Pembroke Hospital? No. Will you be there for me, baby? Here if you need me. I shall conduct inquiries alone. And we can then share our discoveries. Oh my gosh. Will you not visit Pembroke again? No. I must remain discreet and avoid attracting attention to Pembroke Hospital for the time being. But how will you sustain yourself? I shall not, Jonathan. Fear not. I'm used to it. Okay. Well, when will we meet again? again? As soon as you meet Lord Redgrave, I suppose. Fear not, my dear. I shall only be a heart's beat away. Okay, okay. Thank you for all your support and your help. Thank you, girl. Could you do me a last great favor? Well, I'll give you smooch. Elizabeth. I should be Ooh. Honored, my lady. Then it is settled. Elizabeth. Finally, some good news in these dark hours. Thank you. I appreciate the advice. I had best prepare myself to meet this Lord Redgrave now. How thrilling. To meet the Earl of Bristol in the flesh, so to speak. Something tells me you're not very keen on the man. Don't get me wrong. The gentlemen of the Ascalon Club are honorable, but their attitude and opinions are somewhat antiquated. <laughs> I mm. see. As long as they deny access to female applicants, I will leave them to their antediluvian considerations as to the natural order of things. Jonathan. What's up? Promise me you'll be careful. I'll be careful for you, girl. Of course. Ooh, only for you. But why the fear in your voice? Ooh. 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 Damn. Really look at me like a, like a woman. Got no hand on her bosom. We may be deceptive by nature. A bosom. But this heart of mine has always told the truth. Okay. Ooh. Elizabeth. Ooh. Ooh. Damn. Go, my friend. Friend? Come back to me soon. You, you just put. You just t make me touch your titty, and you put me in the friend zone. Really? You do that to me? That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Making me touch your titty, and then put me in the friend zone. Wow. 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 Okay. Alright guys, that is all the time I have for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. It's getting interesting. I finally beat my sister. It was getting crazy. It was getting nuts. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below, share the video, ring the bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.